In this lesson, we're going to learn how to embed a video in Microsoft Excel, and we're going to do it three ways. The first way is using a formula. The second way is by inserting some pictures or objects. And the last way is by using an add-in in Excel. Now, based on your situation, for example, whether your video is private on your computer or uploaded on a shareable website like YouTube, you will select the best methodology for you. So let's start. We go to a blank sheet and we start with the formula. If you see here, I have a link to one of my YouTube videos for my channel. And if you didn't subscribe, please, uh, you can do it right now. And we're gonna use a formula to refer to this. So I'm gonna do equal hyperlink, which is the formula. Then you open the parentheses, you select your link. You can also type it in double quotation mark, then comma, and you can give it a name. So in this name, I'm gonna say watch this cool video. Then I do double quotation, close parenthesis, enter. So if you click on this now, you're gonna go to the video and you can watch it as you can see. Next, we go to the second option. For the second option, I can get a picture. So I can do insert, I can do illustrations. For example, you have pictures, stock images, if you don't have anything on your computer, and then you have many images. So let's assume that I select this first one. I'm going to get a picture here. I can make it way smaller. I can put it here. Then I can go copy this link. Then I right click, I do link. And then I'm going to put the address here. You can also select a video from your computer. It's the same. It will open it. And then you do OK. You click on it. It will open the video. If I select a video from my computer, I'm going to do remove link. I'm going to say link. And then I check my videos. For example, I can go anywhere. I can go to this one. And then let's assume I want this video. So again, if I click on it, it will open the video in media player. So this is the option. Next, you can do embed an object. So you do insert. I know this is counterintuitive, but under text, you have object. So here you do create from file. Then you need to put the file name. So again, if I click and I go to my files, I can go and select this video and I have it. Then I click display icon. So I can change my icon here, but I don't have many choices, which is fine. I'm going to keep this one. And then I have link to file. If I click on link to file, it will embed this as a link. And then I can watch the video using that link. The advantage is that your Excel file will be very light if you do this. Now the disadvantage and this is the same for the other methodologies, is that if you move the video from its location or you send the file to somebody and he doesn't have the video in the same location, then it's not going to work. If you don't click on it, then your video will be embedded in your Excel file. So you can watch it regardless if you have internet, no internet, whatever it is, you can watch it, but your file will become heavy. So I'm going to choose this by not clicking on this to have it embedded in my file. And I'm going to say, OK. And then I get this icon. If I double click on it, I can click here on open and it will open my file. The last methodology is by using a free add in for Excel. And this is if your video is on YouTube. So you do insert add ins. Under my add ins, you can see I have web video player. So if you don't have it, you can go to get add-ins and then you do web video player. You search for it. You'll find it here. You can click on add and get it. Once you do this, it will appear under my add-ins. So you double click on it. You have here a template. You just copy your link to my YouTube 
and then you say set video and this is your video you can make it smaller and then my video is here so when I click on play it will automatically play the video so I hope you enjoyed this lesson and again based on your situation you can experiment with those methodologies and you can embed a video in Excel